Hello and welcome to Times XP. I'm Purnima Pandey and today we are here with some myths about the winter season. Some things you might not know about this fluctuating season, the weather affects your body and how you actually can make the best choices for yourself and your family. Does going outdoor without a jacket really make you sick? Should you be loading up the children with vitamin C in preparation for the winter season or the cold weather that is actually surrounding us right now? So here we are to debunk about five myths about the winter season that will help you and your loved ones stay healthy in this time of the year. On number one, you lose most of your body heat through your head. You don't lose any more heat out of the top of your head than you do from the rest of your body. It's just that when you go outside during winters, everything else is covered except for your head. So it starts feeling colder. A natural defense many people have in their hair, which adds a protective layer from winter cold and winds. Earmuffs and hairbands are useful alternatives to keep your ears warm without causing messy hair. On number two, drinking hot liquids warms you faster than cold liquids. Drinking a cup of hot chocolate or other warm beverage on a cold day is a winter activity that many people actually enjoy, but it could be counterproductive. Drinking warm liquids make you feel warm, but it actually could be cooling your body. The body takes the warm liquid and thinks that the temperature has increased and it works to lower it. So when you drink a warm beverage, do you notice that you start getting a little sweat on your body? So this is your body's way of cooling itself. And when you drink warm liquids, your body actually starts lowering the temperature inside and thus you sweat. So to stay warm, you must not drink a lot of hot or warm uh, beverages or liquids in order to stay warm from inside. Or Myth number three, going outside without a coat will make you sick. But wait, why is it when you step outside into the cold and your nose starts running and you feel congested? It is all because of the cold air. You get sick because of the virus or bacteria, not because you get cold. In the winter months, people are inside more, which allows the germs to spread more easily. Meaning that in winters, when a person gets sick, the likelihood that others will get sick also increases. On number four, vitamin C prevents cold. It won't usually hurt you to take vitamin C, but it doesn't significantly help you either. While taking too much vitamin C usually isn't harmful, it can cause side effects like diarrhea, nausea and headache. For most people, a healthy diet provides an adequate amount of this vitamin, so it's best to talk with your healthcare provider before adding extra vitamin C to your diet. On number five, women are colder than men. The core body temperature of women is a bit warmer than that of men, but studies have found that a woman's exterior body temperature can be up to three degrees colder than a man's. A cooler external body temperature helps in explaining why many women tend to have colder extremities like their heads and feet while uh, men don't actually experience these sensations. This was all about some myths about the winter season. If you like watching our video, then go hit the like button. And don't forget to subscribe to Times XP for more such amazing videos like these. This is me, Purnima Pandey, signing out.